Live from the world's capital markets, here are the financial headlines brought to you by Vantage. Hello and welcome to Tuesday's Daily Financial Digest. Banco de Brazil, Brazil's largest public bank, has enabled the payment of taxes with cryptocurrencies, the bank said in a statement. The service is only available to customers with cryptocurrencies deposited with BitFi, a startup specializing in blockchain solutions in which BB's corporate venture capital arm has invested. Oil prices eased around 1% after rising in the previous session as investors focused on short-term demand concerns stemming from crucial upcoming US inflation data and refinery maintenance in Asia and the United States. Asian stock markets sank ahead of a US inflation update that traders worry might lead to more interest rate hikes. Traders hope inflation data will show upward pressure on US prices is easing, which might encourage the Federal Reserve to ease off efforts to cool business activity and hiring. The last session saw the dollar gain 0.6% against the yen. The MACD is giving a positive signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. The pound-dollar pair gained 0.6% in the last session. The CCI is giving a positive signal. The Bitcoin fell 0.8% against the dollar in the last trading session. The stochastic indicator indicates an oversold market. The gold dropped 0.5% against the dollar in the last session. The ROC is giving a negative signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. The UK's ILO unemployment rate will be released at 0700 hours GMT. The US Consumer Price Index Core at 1330 GMT. Finland's Gross Domestic Product at 0600 hours GMT. The US Consumer Price Index will be released at 1330 GMT. Japan's Industrial Production at 0430 GMT. The Eurozone's Ecofin Meeting at 0700 hours GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Tuesday's financial report. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.